Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com, and I'm here to give a quick overview on how to play the rounding version of Math Balloons. If you're coming in from the web and aren't familiar with MathNook, we have over 200 free math games to play, as well as fun, free uh, puzzle and logic games. There's never any membership or sign-up required. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the game. And when you first start up, this is a menu you'll see. Um, you click the Start button here. We'll take you to the uh, level selection screen. The instructions button will, will take you to the written instructions on how to play the game. This button will take you to the video tutorial that you're watching now. And the more games will take you to our site where you can play the uh, free uh, math and fun games. Okay, let's go ahead and click Start here. Now when you first start out, you'll only be able to play the first level. And the other levels will be locked. And now once you successfully complete a level, you'll get a score here uh, on that level, and the next level will be unlocked. And at that point, you can play the uh, newly unlocked level or any of the previously unlocked levels. And you might want to play the previously unlocked levels to improve your score. Okay, let's go ahead and click the uh, level one, and, and I'll show you how, you how to play. Now, if you notice, all the boxes on the screen have gray backgrounds. The, to successfully complete a level, you will have to turn all the boxes on the game board to uh, with the, to have a yellow background. And the way you do that is making matches of three or four of the same colored balloons. I should say three or more, not three or four. Three or more balloons of the same color, either horizontally or vertically. And that's just like how any other uh, match three game plays, like Bejeweled or other games like that. To, to successfully complete it, you'll have to do that and you'll, in the allotted time, and you'll start out with five minutes, and here's a timer here. If you get a, question, a statement wrong about rounding, um, you'll lose a life. If you lose all five of your lives up here, then uh, you'll have to uh, play the level over again to uh, complete it successfully. So this button here <coughs> it will reset the level and if you notice it every time I click it it uh, it goes it switches to uh, a different game board so this button here will take the main menu this button will toggles the uh, sound I, mean, I should say the music on and off this one t toggles the sound on and off and this is your pause button to pause the game and go ahead and get it going again by clicking that button. Now to make matches what you'll need to do is remove balloons to drop other balloons down into place to make matches and the way you do that is is by reading what it says on the balloon and determining if that's true or false. This one says 56 rounds to 60. That's true so I'm going to go ahead and click true. I made a match there and uh, so I'm not, if you notice I made the four Backgrounds turn yellow there, and I got a kind of a bonus match up there. Okay, I'm going to look around the board and figure out where I can make another match. And if I get rid of this balloon, I'll have these three, these three purple balloons in a row, and it'll knock out these three squares right here. 56 rounds to 60. That's true. Okay, kind of looking around, make I can make another match here by dropping this purple balloon down here. It says 85 rounds to 90. That's true. And got a lot of bonus matches there, and that worked out pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and uh, change up, uh, go ahead and, I guess, make a match here, and I'll get rid of these squares here by getting rid of this purple balloon here. 56 rounds to 60, that's true. And um, looking around on the board, I'm going to go ahead and make a match here. Not that I need to, but it'll change it up and maybe make uh, change the positions of some of these balloons and, and make it easier to make a match up here. 61 to 60, that's true. And actually, I got some bonus matches out of that. It's pretty good. I can drop this one in here and make a match. 87 rounds to 80. That's false. Now, to lose a life, you have to answer one of these wrong, and I'll go ahead and do that. Uh, let me look and see where I want to do this. Um, let's go ahead. I'm going to eventually drop these two down here, but 25 rounds to 20. And that's true, but I'm going to go ahead and answer false, and you'll see me lose a life here, and I get a new statement here. The balloon didn't disappear, got a new statement, 90, and I lost a life. Uh, it says 96 rounds to 100, that's true. And then 48 rounds to 40, that's false. I'm going to go ahead and play through without explaining this. Uh, what I'm doing, hopefully, to try to finish in, in the allotted time, and you kind of just watch and see how it's done. 
Okay, no, no obvious matches here. What I'm going to do is go ahead and drop this orange balloon down here. Make a match there. 81 rounds to 90. That's false. True. Okay, now I'm going to get a match here. 97, 90. That's false. I'm going to try to go fast, so I might make some errors, but that's okay. Okay, now I just have these three squares here, and I've got plenty of time. The bonus matches really help you out, um, and that's why I try to make matches lower on uh, early on, lower uh, on the board because more chance of making matches, bonus matches up here. Okay, um, let's see. Don't have any good pattern here, so I'm just going to kind of mix it up here. Okay, now I've got two red ones here. I'm going to go ahead and keep eliminating this one until a red balloon drops in. red one yet. There we go. Now all I have to do is worry about this square here, and you'll get to see what it looks like when a board is completed, a level is completed. And once I get a green one here, we'll see what that looks like. There we go. And at that point, you get your score, and you can submit the score by uh, clicking this button here, you can go to the next level here. Let me take you back to the main menu. Now, of course, these, are all, these were all open before, but at this point, you'd be able to play the next level that's unlocked. Well, that brings us to the end of the uh, overview for Math Balloons Rounding. I hope that's helped out. I hope you liked the game, and thanks for watching.